is that? Conifer. What is that? It's like a type of tree, coniferous tree. I don't know. This whole tree talk is freaking me out. Carnivores, <laughs> cauliflowers. Okay, what's this fascination with trees, by the way? I'm happy to be here, that's all. All right. Cabin Steve's alone. cabin? Yes. What are you kidding me? <laughs> Steve's cabin's haunted. <laughs> it kind of is, you're right. It is. I told him too. Oh, so cool. Hey, I think they I think there are actual beds up there. And plumbing. Yes, there's plumbing, you big baby. Okay, why don't you put her clothes away? Then I'll start a fire. Yeah, of course. You know it's not a real fireplace, right? Yeah, but this is nice. I just want one romantic weekend before I blow it up. In a few weeks, you won't even want to touch me. No, that's not true. Like, I like this. And yeah, it's not so bad? Oh, man. Not so bad, he said. <laughs> or something? No, it's over there. What if someone's out there missing with the car? Maybe there's no one around here for miles. Well, you should go check her. The battery will be dead by morning. Well, come on. Oh. Come on. Okay. Ray? Shit. Ray? Ray, it's not funny.
When's he called me this week? Thursday. Wednesday. Lunch. Hmm? Wait, Wednesday. I thought we had a yearbook meeting on Wednesday. Yeah, and I got practice Wednesday. I can't make that. What do you mean you can't go to practice? We have to make our list of possible sponsors. I don't know what you want me to say. I got a game Saturday. I can't miss practice. Yeah, I'm out. Navy club has a budget meeting. I give up. We'll just figure it out without you. Fine. Now. About the cabin. Yeah, I hate working outside. Yeah, me too. What? She didn't see us coming at all. It was perfect. Yeah, because her little lamp sucked. If she had the mag light with her from the beginning, we would have been screwed. But she didn't. You know, really, I should have been waiting in the car. I thought we agreed that she wasn't going to get into the car. Well, no, but she goes for the door handle and bam, my mask lit up in the driver's seat. She falls back and you're all there to grab her. Yeah, but I mean, that's the point. She runs away. She thinks she's home free. And then her legs get swept up from under her. You can just see the light leave her eyes, right? Mm. Remember back in June, the beach, we all showed up at once. We scared the fuck out of them. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was pretty good. Pretty good? Did you see the look on that lady's face, man? She was like, ah! <laughs> Sorry. Okay, okay, next time we go together. And no more outdoors. Oh, come on. All right. No more outdoors. Thanks, baby. Habitats and Humanity Affiliates. Coverman wants it on his desk by Friday. And so a piece of wood is the... the hammer and nails and joggers. Okay, uh, you get a chance to look at those posters for the blood drive, or do I have to... Um, uh, if you just show it to uh, Harrison, you can start putting it up. All right, sounds good. Cool. Uh, how would you have used a piece of wood? I don't know, Jenny. Fucking sharpen it. Oh, fuck me. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey. Would it would have worked? Is that supposed to be a time twister? <laughs> no, instead of the axe. Uh, hey. Hey! Where were you last night? I texted you like six times and two of those were cat videos. <laughs> yeah, I saw. Um, I was writing a paper. I know. No distractions while you're working. You get me. <laughs> that I do. Oh, I got the tripod for tomorrow. It's so good. Oh, could we actually do it later this week? Well, what's the tripod for? Uh, she's helping me film my, my dance application. Oh. She's a really good dancer. Yeah, she is. Um, I guess I'll see you later then. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Bye. Bye. Hey. Hey. You know I could have let you borrow my tripod, right? So 
So you're just going to sit there whittling while she's running away? All I'm saying is we should have thought it through. But, you know, brought our own supplies. Well, there's a hundred things we could use there. It's called on-site procurement. Derek, you play way too many video games. I don't know how you're giving me shit for this. Your whole plan was for them to see the flashing lights in the car and just come running out. No, no, I had a fallback plan. Which was? Which was to turn the water off, okay? They either come out to fix it or to take a piss. And what if they pissed in the sink? Ew. <laughs> when were you planning on telling us this? He wasn't. He thinks he's some sort of eight-dimensional chess player who's smarter than us. Okay. All right, you got a plan for everything? I like to just use what's ready and available. Whatever happened to just good old choking somebody? You can strangle someone if it's part of the plan. Derek could strangle half the people in this school. Couldn't you, baby? Thank you, sweetie. I'm sure he could, okay? But if we don't plan, we can't come to school anymore. If we don't plan, we're gonna end up in jail. Or worse. Try that choking idea on you, huh? Awesome, you're stronger than me. Fucking Neanderthal. Okay, if we want to bring an axe, we have to plan for it. If we fail to plan, plan to fail. Okay, so why don't we just make a supply checklist? No. No more checklists. No more prepping, planning. Got enough homework as it is. This is supposed to be fun. At school. All right? called us in. The paper got an anonymous tip. They called us. They said they'll do whatever they can to help us catch the guy. Yeah, well, that would be your first, wouldn't it? You've been on the force, what, six years, Mike? Be six in January. And how many homicides we had in the county before this year? Just a Nicholson thing. Yeah, that was a rough one. And how many this year? Three. Three. You think they're connected? Where's the other body? Captain John Mason approaches the village, somewhere near the, the Mystic River. Now, he doesn't have enough men to get through the wall, so he lights the whole thing on fire, gives the order to his men to shoot anyone who tries to escape. Man, what kind of sicko would set someone on fire? Somewhere between four and 700 Pequots are killed, mostly women and children. Now, where I'd like to open this up to you guys is how Mason, or any of the English colonies for that matter, how they justify something like this. Mr. Gordon. I mean, what's there to justify? You mess with the best, you die like the rest, right? Hmm. Uh, well, yeah. Um, that's certainly a popular sentiment at this country's T-shirts and bumper stickers, but, um, <laughs> but we are talking about a massacre of innocent people here, Mr. Gordon. What is the moral argument here? Yeah, the other Mr. Gordon. Well, the moral argument is an illusion. The idea that there's some absolute law made by the weak to protect themselves. You've, um... You've been reading Nietzsche, Ian. And you should watch out. Adolescent testosterone and Nietzsche is a pretty dangerous uh, combination. <laughs> The people we are talking about here were so devoted to their interpretation of Christianity that they are willing to go across the ocean to live it out. Now, how can they possibly justify something like this? Because they're Christian. Yeah. But you can do better than that. That's the whole Calvinist worldview. Some people are saved and others are damned and it's already decided. And clearly the Pequots aren't saved since they're not living like Puritans, so it doesn't really matter what you do to them. Yeah, interesting argument. The point is, um, 
But the Calvinist worldview gives a lot of latitude to do horrible, horrible things. What if some of those... Um Horrible, horrible things tomorrow. Um, Jamestown papers on my desk. Okay, here we go. Two dead in Grand Lake Massacre. Two does not count as a massacre. <laughs> I know, right? The bodies of Ray Highstand and Gina Tenali were discovered early this morning by park rangers at a remote cabin. Premarital is not the Lord's way. Seriously? Well, maybe she didn't change her name. No, here it is. Friends said the two had been dating for three years, blah, blah, blah. Police wouldn't release details of the murders. Miss Tenali. What? Miss Tenali recently told her friends she was expecting their first child. So. I mean, it's not like we could have saved her. That was one of our rules right from the beginning. No kids. She wasn't even showing. It was just a bunch of cells. Not like we killed a squalling infant. No, I know, you're right. You're totally right. Great. So Friday? What's Friday? I was thinking some kind of late night activity. You know. What? Like another one? <laughs> Why Friday? It's Halloween. <laughs> oh, we're serious. <laughs> it doesn't that seem... I thought the whole point is that it's supposed to be, you know, a random act. Halloween seems a little cliched. It's not cliched. It's classic. It's our first Halloween since we started. We can't just sit at home. That is so not a good idea. We should be lying low. Isn't that one of our rules, though? No patterns? I don't see how that fits. We waited, what, six weeks before the last one? Seven weeks before that? Six weeks before that? Mm. That's a pattern. Okay, well, why don't we wait longer? Like, maybe a few months? A few months? Well, I just gotta get my applications in soon, and then we're heading into midterms. Since when do you have to worry about midterms? It just seems like a lot. And, and, and now killing that kid, I get it, just a bunch of cells, but... I don't know, maybe it'll make the police look into it a little harder. I say we cool it for a bit. So what, you can go to parties, get drunk, is that it? No, <laughs> that's not it at all. But maybe we should, maybe we should go to parties, act normal. Hey, how about this? We do this one, and then nothing until New Year's. Your applications can wait a week, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Yes. All right, if everything, if everything works out, we move forward. If it doesn't, we scrap it. Deal? Deal. Deal.
Hey. Hey. Coming with us? Uh, I think it's just the two of us. Derek couldn't get out of practice. What about Miriam? Miriam is with Layla. As usual. All right, let's go then. Oh, man. Yeah. Hey, Mike. They ran the story. She was pregnant. God damn. Fucking animal. Gotta call forensic. Make sure they keep their mouth shut on this one. I'm sick and tired of reading about this shit. Fucking newspapers. What you got? Got the files from Jackson County. Like pulling teeth. Yeah, some things never change. Okay, looks like we had one the same night it was closed. Got a twofer. Looks like a meth deal gone bad by the looks of things. Hang on, four others. That seem high to you? Yeah, and for them. They don't have the slightest idea where to start. No witnesses, no suspects, no connections. Yeah, just like us. What you got there? Winchester back in June. The guy had this photo emailed to him right around the time of death. Hang on. Woman last night emailed that photograph right before she was killed. You think what I'm thinking? Well, you get many pictures like that emailed to you from unknown senders. Call the DA. Get that warrant we need. It's time we reopen these cases. I'll look into it. Let me know. Forensic, please. project with you and Miriam coming along. It's not coming along, and I'm done doing it by myself. Miriam and Layla are pairing up. Wow. Really losing your number one spot to the girls' team, huh? It's not that. Really? Okay, I just... She spent so much time with her lately, and I feel like it's not in line with what we're doing. You think she's gonna snitch? No, no. I know she wouldn't. I just... I don't want her to slip up. This one's fine. There's a gun rack on the 4x4. No security system. <gasps> Those signs are all fake. It's too close to the road. What about this one? Garden raking leaves. Pause chopping wood. Shit. What? Look at him, he looks like a fucking psychopath. Okay, you wanna move on then? Oh, fuck that. There's not enough room in this town for all of us. What now? Let's go play some pool. <laughs> all right, let's go get Derek. I don't get why we couldn't finish the game. Well, it's almost two, and we have school tomorrow, Derek. Yeah, I just think you don't like to lose. <laughs> okay, whatever. Come on. What's the rush? I have to do that paper for Volman. Six pages on the Jamestown colony. You haven't done that yet? I have to do footnotes. Slacker. <laughs> All right. Mm, I'll see you later. Yeah. Good night, baby. Bye. 
Just... I figure what would kill you to maybe not kiss you in front of me. I don't know, maybe just a... Okay, whatever. <laughs> Get over here. Hi, Dad. That was Jenny's car I just saw, right? Well, she uh, just finished a family dinner thing, and uh, she's coming over to grab some calc notes. Yeah, I get it. Both of you fully dressed, 2 o'clock in the morning. Guys, look, I know I drive you crazy busting your balls like this. But I love you. Just trying to keep you out of trouble, that's all. Next year, you're going to be in college doing God knows what. Till then, how about we follow some rules, huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. OK, get over here. Give your old man a hug. 2 in the morning, 2.30, for Christ's sake. On school night, huh? Go to bed. Get out of here. Sorry, Mr. Bowman, I didn't realize you were in here. Today is Tuesday, isn't it? Yeah, and on a Tuesday you have a, you have a planning committee meeting in here. Yeah, uh, but it, we can find somewhere else, not a problem. No, 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 don't worry. Um, I, can go, I can go eat lunch in my car. Okay. Hey, Mr. Bowman. Hi, Jenny. Um, Ian, I... Uh, I have something for you. What's this? Think of it as the anti-Nietzsche. Look, you know, I know what it's like to be a smart teenage kid, OK? If you could have seen me 10 years ago, dressed all in black, trying to liberate myself from the illusion that life has any meaning whatsoever. Look, I guess all I'm trying to say is I think it's important that you establish an opposition, a dialogue, and I think this could do just that. Maybe you read it and it changes the way you look at the world, or maybe you put it in your backpack and forget all about it. So it goes, OK? Hey. Hi. Hey, Ian, can I borrow that when you're done with it? Oh, I'm, I'm done. <coughs> story house with a basement. There's a garage about 10 feet away and a barn about 20 feet past that. Three buildings? That's a lot to control. Yeah, we'll have to keep them in the house. What if they make a run for it? <sighs> I think I can outrun a senior citizen. He's 50. Then we'll keep him fenced in. What next? They have a front door that they keep unlocked until bedtime, around 11, and side door not a problem. Cheap lock. Where'd you get those? I went back after I dropped you at home. Stuck around until about 3. A.M.? Mm hmm I'm sure dad'll leave the country for months on end. Yeah. Having a dad who can't stand to be around me totally rules. Grass is greener. Their names are Dave and Catherine Lauterbach. Oh, 60 bucks on a credit card, which isn't getting paid. And they have a friend in Midland with a new grandkid. That's all I got. We need the floor plan. Who's free after school? I can probably get out of band. Great, then we'll head to City Hall, as long as I'm back before dinner. Sounds, Sounds good. Sounds like a plan. What are you going to tell your parents when they ask what you've got there? Uh, sociology, a visual history of the suffragette movement. Are you actually doing that in sociology? Yeah, of course. Every good lie has at least 95% truth. Um, do you want to come in for dinner tonight? Or even just hang out for a few minutes? Nah, your parents are too nice. It kind of freaks me out. Suit yourself. Good night.
Hey, monkey. Hey, Dad. What's that? Oh, uh, it's white chili with enough cheese to kill a horse. What's in the tube? Just a visual history of the suffragette movement. Oh, can we see? It's not ready yet, but uh, I'm just going to drop my stuff upstairs and then I'll be right back down. Yeah. Make us proud, sweetie. <laughs> Is that too much? Well, she's a hard worker. Sure is. David L. Lauterbach, 55, married Catherine Sklarski when they were in their late 20s. She doesn't have a record, but he got picked up for vagrancy when he was 30. Vagrancy? I don't know, hitchhiking maybe, it doesn't say. No weapon permits. One landline, one cell phone in her name, got both numbers. Credit score is good, not great. That's it? Yeah, they really like to live off the grid. No, we can do better than that. He is not on the internet. She has a Facebook account, seven friends, five of which are relatives. She likes gardening and leaves typical old person comments on her sister's kids' pictures. <laughs> That's pathetic. So, what are we gonna wear? What do you think? Creepy or what? It's, it's all right. I'd prefer something that covers the whole face. Well... I don't know, what if we make our own masks? Like, maybe potato sacks, eye holes cut out? It's been done before. When has it been done before? I don't know, in like every slasher movie ever. Yeah, I guess so. Guys, what about these? Holy shit. Jeez. I used to play a lot of dress up as a kid. More like animals? <laughs> Not just animals. Look. Totally creepy. Yep, it's a little disconcerting. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, I've got a bunch of stuff. Zombies, skulls, sexy ladies. Sexy ladies? That's what it says on the label. There's no thematic unity. So? So who's gonna be scared of four people in mismatched masks? I don't know. Why don't we get a bunch of these and swap them out? They'll think there's like 20 people hunting them. I like it. I don't know. What, what about coherence? <laughs> coherence? Fuck coherence. It's about motherfucking chaos. This thing shakes some shit up.
Should I go again, or? No, Nia. Are you sure? I just, I don't know, I feel like the turns are off, and it was perfect. just surprised me. In a good way? Yeah. In a good way. Where's everyone else? Derek's in the washroom. Three guesses where Miriam is. With Layla? Got it in one. Hey, do you mind if I borrow those notes from Ruaz's class today? No. What the hell is that? It's, it's nothing, okay? I was, I was gonna get rid of it. It's from the cabin, isn't it? You were gonna put this in Volman's desk? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Ian, please. I'm not stupid. I know you're trying to pin this on Volman. Okay, yeah. It's insurance. You know, just in case things don't go to plan. What do we got? Take a look, okay, we got something. All seven cases but one. Each victim received a different photograph emailed to them from an unknown sender. That's a deliberate pattern, Mikey. Deliberate, the obscure. I mean, who takes a picture of a candy wrapper? I don't know. Look, how you get along with the warrant from the DA, we gotta start tracing this thing down. Yeah, I'm working on it. Okay, good. Look, I'm gonna head out to the scenes, okay? Maybe we missed something. I think this one thinks he's smarter than this. Let's prove him wrong, yeah? Let me know. we Will do. Turn around and they see us. Right. I'm gonna be blocking the kitchen door here. 
Darius, you're in the living room. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, I get up, they panic, and they make it to the hallway. And if they overpower you? And then I make a run for it this way. Derek? I mean, we've been over this like a million times, dude. We get it. We know where they are. attack Miriam, where do you go? I don't know. I cry and turn myself in. <laughs> we'll figure it out, all right? We're fine. Come on, it's six. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, let's go. We got a lot to do tonight. I'll pick you guys up at nine. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Are you okay? You seem distracted. I'm fine. You know that we need you for this. Okay, I know you got a lot going on, but this is the... The last one. So. For now. And I think me and you both know it's not true. You got better things going on. It's not like that. Oh, no, it's, it's exactly like that, but it's okay. I just need you to be focused. For tonight. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Okay. Okay. anything yeah I did all of it photographs all taken here even a laptop and he said the emails from here I think we're gonna get that bastard do you need forensics yeah send him over
Doesn't that look like the place that we were with my sister? Mm -hmm. Don't worry about it. We don't have candy. The kids will go away. Who's out there? They say it's probably just some kids fooling around. They're gonna send someone over, but not for a couple hours. I'm gonna need something stronger. And then you'll be awake all night tossing and turning. I'll meet you halfway and I'll get you more sugar. I'm already sweet enough. Yes, you are. Gotta get out of here at the window. You left your phone in the living room. That's not my phone. Oh God, don't answer. Call me, please. Press ignore. No, the other button. Wait, how, how do I Wait, do that? Okay, here, give it to me. Three. 
What do you want from us? You coward! Shut up! None of these are good. Jazz, country, blues, none of these seem ominous enough. Not even as, like, ironic counterpoint. It's all about juxtaposition. Whatever you put on is gonna seem creepy and weird. Hurry up, you're first. Heather! Baby, you know you don't have to wear that anymore. But I like it. It makes me feel pretty and elegant. Take it off. Love you, sorry, missus. How'd you guys do in Robinson's class today? Nah, no, I think I missed the one on boys. Hey. <laughs> Pick up the thing. Fuck. Six. Ian, how'd you hit that dude? You sure you can kill him? Last time I checked, he was breathing. Is that me? Yeah, it's me. Hey, uh, Jenny. Pick up two, pick up four. Ooh. I could kill you. I actually think we already have that covered, so... Do you guys remember Darby? She was... in our grade two class, I think. And... She always had her hair in pigtails. We were so close. We told each other everything. And then one day, she just moved away and we never spoke. this why no reason
Once you get that. Basement. Try to revise. Improvisation. Fuck me. Nicely done. <sighs> She didn't get in the first place, Derek. Shut up for two minutes. There's a door back here. I think I can kick it through and one of us could fit. Great. Who's going in? I'm going in. Down for this, Jenny. Take him the fuck out. I'm taking out no one, okay? Just shut the fuck up. Anyway, I'll go check it out. There's nothing out here.
I'll help you. I'll help you. I will. You don't have to do it. You don't want to do this. You don't have to do it. supposed to be here. It's, it's not registered. Anyway, that wasn't your fault. No, it's not fucking okay, Derek. For once, something isn't fixable, okay? Your friend is dying. It's fucking torture the place. Burn the evidence. No, we're not leaving her here, okay? What do you want to do? Take her to the hospital, go to jail for the rest of your We're not fucking leaving her here, okay? You idiot. Stop arguing, all right? Help me get her in the car. You get the fire going. Let's go. If we don't, Derek, if we fuck. take her there, we're fucked. You don't think the cops are going to start asking us questions? We can handle the cops. No, it's way too suspicious to start poking around. We got to do something about her. Do something. Listen to yourself, okay? This is our friend, Derek. We can't fucking take her there, all right? What are we going to do? We're all right, Miriam. Be careful, okay? We're careful. Ian, we can't take her back. We got to get rid of her. <sighs> I can't believe you guys are fucking saying that she's still alive. We can save her, please. It's either her or us. Look at me, okay? Listen. All right, just chill the fuck out. No, no, no. We can't make that choice, okay? She's gonna die, Derek. Listen to me. We can't take her to the hospital. your life in jail? Guys, it's too late. She's gone. Fuck! Fuck, fuck! Perfect, but her dad keeps a shotgun in the study. No, slugs are way too much of a mess. Derek, we can do this. We have about three hours before her blood starts pooling. Okay, okay. this might work. What are we talking about? Our parents will hear us. They'll know. No, they won't. We sneak in, get Miriam into her bedroom, shoot her, 
Steal a bunch of shit, then get the hell out of there. Yeah, dispatch. That 211 was a prank call. That lady was not happy about me waking her up at this time of night. Nobody appreciates us. Why don't you head on back? Will do. Dispatch, we got a fire at the Ladderbright place. Get me fire out there right now, goddammit. Shit. Yeah, I got her. Up. Wait, why not just kill her parents? Problem solved. No, we're not killing them. I got her keys. Look, okay, me and Jenny are gonna take care of her. What? You're standing out here, all right? No, wait out here. It's fucking cool. You're fucking standing out here, Derek, okay? Now look up. Take her. I got her. Stick to the plan. We have a problem. What? There's no exit wound. The bullet's still in there. This doesn't work with another bullet in there. We have to get it out. Do you want me to do it? No, oh, let's just... You get rid of the body clothes. Downstairs, I don't know, make, make the robbery look convincing. And then go tell Derek to pull the car up.
What are you doing? Who was supposed to be involved in this mystery? Ian, this isn't you. You don't know who I am. You don't know anything about me. You don't know what I'm capable of. You don't even know who your own daughter was. Get it together right now. We have an insurance plan, remember? Put this on Volman, well, just like we planned. We have a plan, Jenny. If the plan went to shit, how are we gonna put this on Volman if Volman's not here? He'll be here. He'll be here. I was gonna be here at this time, Jenny. He'll be here. Oh? I texted him from Miriam's phone. He'll be here. Trust me. Her off. I'll start clean up. You know, no, 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 don't do this. Miriam's mom. No. Please, how does this work if she's still alive? No. It doesn't. The plan doesn't work. Ian, she's no different than any of the others. Come on. Please. We're running out of time. Come on. I can't do it. No. Can't. Ian. I can't lie to my dad. It's not about Derek and we'll know. No. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. You can't lie to your dad. Confirm that address, please. 43 Whitaker. Jesus Christ.
Jenny, um, let's just put the gun down, okay? Where's, um, where's Miriam, Jenny? Is someone hurt? Jenny, are you okay? You killed her. Is someone hurt? <laughs> Oh,